feeling in my body and I know it is not arousal because there's no damn way I can be aroused from something god I need a beer mm. <sighs> uh. Why am I thinking about that? Why am I thinking about that human? That's a human that bothers the fuck out of me. That human that asked me questions about Grim Reapers and freaking kissed me. I hope she is a human and not a demon. Well, if she is, then she's gonna be dead. You know, when she did kiss me, I did have this strange feeling afterwards, even though I did start, you know, gagging and all that other stuff. But I still think about it and I don't know why. What in the Sam Ham is this feeling? You're behind me, aren't you? Please tell me it's a different human. I'm just gonna slowly turn around and oh bloody hell, then it's you. What is it you want? What do you want from me? Look, if you want to say it, go ahead. No, I am not blushing. That is not why I'm not turning around. My back is going to face you because I don't want to look at you. I am still mad at you for what you did to me. A sudair? What does that mean? What in Blimey's Earth does that mean? I, I am not one of those. Are you on some kind of crack? Or... Some other drugs in this world? <sighs> Whatever. I don't know if I'm that old because us Reapers never age or what. Hold on, let me. Let me actually look it up on my iPad. Oh, haha, ha, very funny. Yes, I did call myself old, but I am not that old. I'm not like 80 years old. So how you spell it? T S U oh, I'm sorry the Sude It's a Japanese term for a character development process that describes a person who is initially cold before gradually Showing a, a warmer, friendlier side over time. Is that what you think of me? Cold, but all of a sudden I turn nice and sweet. I don't see that for myself. Sorry. But I would love to have a word with you. Now before you start squealing like a little pig like you are. But I want to say this, not in public. Only because I just don't want boss seeing me. And then I get in so much trouble and I will blame you for this. Even though I am the one who talked to you. But again, I told- wait, didn't I just say I don't want to see your face or else I would kill you? Why haven't I? I'll explain that. Come on. Come to my place. 
I'm gonna talk in a, in a private place than in the public. Now, I do have a maid, which she is on holiday. I did give her a holiday because she was working to the finger to the bone and I just had to give her a holiday. I, it's not that far. Yes, that mansion is mine. I am not that fancy. I mean, I always needed a good living condition. You know. But come along. <sighs> well, I am off duty, so... I was planning on coming home since there is nothing in the to die list, which I wish there was, so I can make it an excuse to get away from you. My bl blimey hell, why is it so bloody hot? Oh, did my maid forgot to turn on the air conditioner? Oh man, it's gonna take nine years to cool off. Oh, whatever. Well, at least it'll give me an excuse to strip down. Actually, I'm just gonna be more ladylike and not walk around my mansion naked since I do not have any other servants. Just my maid. She does the cooking and the cleaning. And sometimes I do the cooking and cleaning so she doesn't have to make more work. <sighs> Yes, it is beautiful. Even though I don't deserve a huge mansion like this. <sighs> oh, God. Except for the first time I ever took off my glasses. Even though us rippers are not allowed to take off my glasses. And for some reason, my vision is not very blurry. I think last time I lost my glasses. Probably because my eyes were not used to all the glasses. <laughs> but I want to tell you something. Now, how did you feel when you kissed me? Oh, don't give me that. Oh, don't give me that I don't remember card. I remember every single detail that happened. You remember? You kissed me. Not on the cheek, not on the neck, not on the forehead or the nose. The lips. Yeah. Ring any bells. And not only that, you were touching me a little, you know, wrapping your arms around my waist. Oh, I had to take a hot shower from that. Not that I just use a gallon of laundry soap. <sighs> you just love the lie, don't you? What do you mean you don't remember? We you just suddenly got amnesia or something? Did a rock fall on your head after that? Yeah, that's what I thought. But yeah, I had to use a gallon of laundry soap. Since you did touch me, and I had to use probably a whole entire bottle of body wash. And I did a good scrub, but let me tell you, all these human germs, Jesus. But... I'm gonna have to get used to it because, yeah, there is something I want to tell you. Oh, what do I start? Uh, oh God, here we go. <laughs> yes, I did. I... I don't like you. 
No, let me speak. I don't like you. I love you. I don't know why. I mean, I hate you. Because you're human. And you're annoying as fuck. But I love you. Oh, Jesus. Maybe I am one of those Sudera people? I want to get closer to you. So, will you be my partner? But do not tell anyone. This relationship is going to be secret. I don't know how we're going to do this in the public when we hang out. Because I do have green eyes. And people know a difference between a human being and a reaper. Maybe I need some color contacts. So, like, brown contact lenses to hide my green eyes. And I don't know what boss is going to say. I'm going to have to... Try my hardest to make sure a boss does not see me holding hands with a human like you. I would date the rest of the Reapers, but us, we are not. I'm pretty much breaking. What rule was that? Number 18? Yeah. Number 18 is we are not allowed to date. I know it's sad, but... You know why? The only reason why we're not dating is because dating distracts work. And if a breakup ever happens, and I mean, if for let's make an example, one of my co-workers had a boyfriend, and the boyfriend broke up with her. She can't focus on her work if she can't stop thinking about that breakup, and then it distracts her, and she starts whining and crying. Like a little bitch. So. I'm gonna try my best to act normal. No, it's... I'm not... Fu no, it's fine. It's not like I'm forcing myself to date you. Because this is how I really feel. I know it's just right out of the, the blue. But when you did kiss me and when you did touch me, I did have this strange feeling. The reason why I was saying those things was because I was pretending to not like you. Deep down to my very core, I did like you. But I had to pretend I don't like you. Because I was too embarrassed to tell you that I like you. I don't know if you felt the same way that you liked me. You a little bit did. So that's why I called you a cold... No, wait. I called you a vile, venomous, toxic person. And I apologize for calling you that. I guess it is like love and first sight. I mean, when I did see you, my heart just... Pounded right out of my chest. I feel like it was gonna burst like a juicy red berry. So, will you be my partner? Hey guys, Brittany here, and thank you for watching the video. Now, before we call this a wrap, um, I want to say a huge thank you to Celestial ASMR. AKA Day, if you're watching this, I want to say thank you for supporting me and this channel from this situation I currently am. I never had someone so supportive in my whole lifetime. I'm not saying all you subscribers aren't supportive, but him, on the other hand, is like the main supportive person in the whole world. Thank you. I really appreciate it. I, my question is, I don't know how you know my channel, how you found my channel, but I'm not complaining. I'm really not. I just want to say thank you for, you know, that comment you said in my, you know, 
venting video I did. I mean, I never had someone so supportive. So I just want to say a huge thank you to Celestial ASMR. Um, if you want to, you can subscribe to Celestial ASMR. If you want to, please. <laughs> you have to. His videos are pretty much better than mine, to be honest. <laughs> um, and you know, he, he's really good. I watched his videos, listened to them, and it's just mind blowing. <laughs> really is and I'm fucking jealous <laughs> teach me your skills teach me your skills sensei <laughs> anyways I want to say thank you and thank you all for watching and I will see you later bye